So I'm really excited today. Um, it's Christmas season. We got a Christmas ornament, and this turned out fantastically. I didn't expect to build it this way, and all of a sudden, it just came and was developed in like less than two minutes of time almost. So let's go check out how I built it. And again, if you want to play along, there's a link to the kit down below. Thanks everybody. Let's go check out how I built this really cool Christmas ornament. Okay, bye-bye. So a Christmas ornament. Again, we're doing all these Christmas items and I'm having lots of fun with it. So let's go ahead, put five minutes on a clock, and let's build a Christmas ornament. Now this is gonna be really tricky. Um, what we do need is this. Do I have a white version of that as well? Because we need more than one. I am going to build a full-size tutorial on how to build a very nice uh, Christmas ornament. But right now, so this is the quintessential item that you need for a ornament, which is the, you know, I call it like a hinge or if not something else, but it's gonna be hard to build a Christmas ornament multi-sided. Hmm, that's tricky. Okay, I can build up the sides. Okay, got it, like that. Okay, so we're gonna have a multicolored, all the all the sides are gonna be different colored. Okay, that works. Thinking through, right? You gotta play through and find what you can build with the kit that you have, right? If you have limited resources, it doesn't matter. You know, it doesn't matter. If you have limited resources, it doesn't matter. If you have some Legos, Go ahead and start building something. Um, everybody loves Legos during the holiday season. Look at that. That's kind of cool. It gives a 3D, uh, you know, feel to it. That, that, that works out. Let's do that on this side too. Kind of makes it look like there's like a little yellow star on the side, uh, which is neat. Uh, that works. And then. Maybe we'll do something like that on the front, right? Actually, that looks really good. Wow, that turned out much better and quicker than expected. Look at that. We have a Christmas ornament already. Wow. Wow, okay. That turned out really good. What am I, like a minute or two in? And we got a Christmas ornament. I, I don't know that I'm gonna be able to top that. I mean, I guess I could work on the back side. I mean, come on. Come on now, that is quite amazing. Yeah, we're gonna do the back side. Just like that. Come on now, that is a Christmas ornament if I've ever seen it. And uh, that looked re that looks really good. Maybe if I add a little embellishment like that. Nope. How about on the sides though? That That's not too bad. That looks good. Kind of rounds off this corner that we're looking at here. Come on. I'm really liking that. I'm excited about this. Come on now. This is a Christmas ornament. I'm going to do a tutorial on, on like a really professional version of this. But in like two minutes of time, we have a Christmas ornament. And that is fantastic. It, you know, it's three dimensional. It's got a different facade on this side than on this side. Come on, but it's all symmetrical. I am really proud of that. That came in, that's, that came together. Did I have this in mind when I started building? No, I did know that I wanted to use the, the hinge piece and uh, I was thinking, okay, red and red and maybe use white, um, but these sticking out on the side, 
that's amazing and then based on that we did the, the the yellow on the front and the top and then it brings the whole thing together if you just start building something out of legos you don't know what is going to come of it so just go start building and see what comes of it and then you might find that uh uh you build something that you didn't expect and that's sometimes the best thing ever nope um so there you go this is gonna be a short video because I'm already done. Um, so there you go. So that that turned out really good. We're turning turn ah uh, turn the clock off. I like it a lot. I think it turned out really good for the amount of time and the pieces that we have and everything else. I think that turned out excellent. Okay, if you want to play along, if man. Uh, if you think that this turned out really good, leave a comment down below. And if you don't, leave a suggestion on how we could have made this better. And uh, if you want to play along, there's a link to the kit down below. And I want you to build something. Go ahead and build anything. Out of Legos, out of dirt, out of sand, out of whatever you got. Make something. Take a picture of it and post it on our social medias. At MakeShareDaily or hashtag MakeShareDaily. And we'll get it, we'll check it out, we'll review it, we'll tell you whether or not we thought it looked good or not. But the main thing is, is that you go out and make something each and every day. Go build something, it makes you feel better about yourself, it makes the world look at you differently, it's great. Just go out and build something. So in order, that was pretty difficult. Now let's spin the wheel and find out what we're going to build in tomorrow's episode. We have so many more items to do for Christmas. So let's spin the wheel and find out what we get. Oh, it's a Christmas tree. One of the most iconic items during Christmas time is the Christmas tree. Now let's go try to build it out of 221 pieces. That, that's not very green. So let's go figure out how we're gonna build it in tomorrow's episode. See you tomorrow, bye-bye.